Sometimes kids don't know the abilities that they really have. Good teachers see, see those abilities and they know how to motivate that and pour that out of people. And that's what happened to me. And at an early age, it was my art teacher who sort of gave me a spark in life. For me to be told I had some talent, that just opened my heart to, hey, doing what I needed to do to try. It motivated me to even want to go to school. And because of two or three teachers, I chose to go to college. I started out as a migrant teacher. From there, I went to an art teacher. From there, I became an assistant principal at three of our schools. From there, I became a principal at three different schools. From being a principal, I went to central office and became a director. From an executive director, I became superintendent. The greatest concern that I had at that time when I took the office was the teacher turnover rate. The teacher turnover rate was 35%. Being a new administrator, you're challenged with the idea of trying to improve student achievement. And, and I'm saying to myself, how can you improve student achievement when you're losing a third of your teachers every year? You, you need that stability, it's not there. And even as a principal, I had teachers that came to me and said, look, uh, I can't find anywhere to live. The housing uh, situation is not that great. We can't accept the job. So I was talking to James Ewell. That was a great moment for Hereford County Public And I was, we were talking about the problems we were having. We decided that let's do something about the housing situation that we were having have an affordable housing. The State Employees Credit Union gave us $2.2 million to build a teacher housing complex for our teachers. My role in that was to attract to retain teachers in the district for our children. The housing complex makes it more convenient for them, makes it easier for them in the sense that they're going to have qualified teachers in the classroom more so now than they did before. We went from 35% teacher turnover rate to 12% teacher turnover rate in one year. We have provided a means of scholarships for children, programs for teachers, support for teachers, in terms of things they want to do and can't do. All of that, to me, I saw it as a part of giving back. And not just a part of giving back, a part of leaving a legacy that would be here for years and years to come. It was a um, team effort from everybody in the community to help, and State Credit Union pretty much led the way. I'm very fortunate. I feel very fortunate. I feel very fortunate to be in the position. I feel very fortunate to have helped the children that I've helped. I think the most rewarding position I've ever had was working with, with students. I'm showing them and teaching them the possible things they could do when they didn't know they could do it. And that's what, that's what teaching is all about. Kids come to us, they don't know what they can do. They don't know what they can learn, but you have to teach them. And once they find out, then they go on their own, then they fly.